Hey, good morning everyone. Welcome back. If you're new here, my name is Jess. I'm a mom vlogger. I like to vlog about being in a blended family, taking care of my two kiddos, my work schedule, morning and night routines. And now today we're talking about being a YouTuber. If you like to see those types of videos, make sure you like this video, subscribe to my channel, leave any questions in the comment section down below. I answer every single comment. We are just gonna do a day in the life of a YouTuber. So I have some editing to do. I have to schedule some things in my planner and trying to figure out videos and when I'm gonna film them because you know I do work on top of this. Um, this is just a part-time gig. Um, I don't make much money from it but I still like to upload my life and uh, make some sort of money from it. Um, I like to stay consistent for the last year. I have been very consistent. I haven't missed an upload in over a year. Um, and I will show you some things that I use to help with my business. Come on, bud. This is my two-year-old, Oliver. I vlog a lot about him. And then I also have an 11-year-old who is in a blended family. Um, she goes to her dad's every other week. Between her going to school and me using my computer, that's how I get things done, um, or at nighttime. So today, I got up kind of late later than i want to i usually get up at like 5 a.m when i'm filming and i go on my computer and try to figure out what today's video is going to be like if i haven't already and then i start filming early because i don't like filming later in the day i'm super tired from you know chasing around a toddler all day so i film early i get up get dressed and put on some makeup because nobody wants me looking like a hot mess in these vlogs so i put on some makeup and then i start vlogging and that's how i've always started my stuff in the last year and it's been working out for me um i'll show you guys how i do my thumbnails and stuff like that um but yeah this is just me working through my day as a youtuber so let's go uh go get started on breakfast because i'm starving and get this little one dressed because he's doing his jammies <laughs> Felt I'm done with the defense Throw back and climb over your fence Hide to show, show you that I was a mess So you were shrugging your shoulders I'm closed off, that's what I told you Soon enough, everything started to change Cause there's no going back, no going back There's no going back to your own life no Living in the past I'm feeling it tonight, riding on the dizzying heights. So I watched this thing on TikTok where you put the boiled eggs in water in a container and you just shake them. And the shells will just come off. It worked yesterday, so let's see if it works today. Perfectly de-shelled eggs. Okay, so I just finished eating. Ollie's actually still eating. He didn't want his eggs. He wanted the Rice Krispie treat, so that's just what it is. Um, he's eating still. I'm waiting for him to finish. I have to put him in underwear, so then we're gonna go upstairs and get dressed. He will be in just underwear and a t-shirt today because one, it's hot, and two, we're still potty training, so um, I like to just, while we're in the house, just not have pants on him. So if you see just underwear, that's, it is what it is. Um, so, at this time, like, I really can't do anything until he takes his nap, and I will say that, like, once I go back to work, I'll probably be taking my laptop with me along with all of my supplies and edit stuff at work when I have downtime or doing my lunch and stuff like that. So, um, this is basically what I'll be doing once I go back to work full-time, but as a full-time mom right now, staying home by myself and not really having any help, I can't sit at my desk and work because Ollie gets really upset and he just climbs all over and draws over everything so I just wait it out until his nap time and I usually get between like two two and a half hours of him sleeping so I can get things done I like I said this morning I need to edit an entire video I need to plan some videos out and I'm gonna show you guys what tools I use for editing how to do my thumbnails and like where I come up with my ideas so I'm gonna show you all that uh, but we have to wait until Ollie takes his nap so yeah, this is just 
what I do throughout the day. Um, I do need to put away clothes when I put him, like get him dressed. Um, but, set, but besides that, I really don't have anything else to do other than to clean the kitchen, which I'll get to tonight. Um, I think the trash men should be coming soon, so I wanna open up the door and listen for them because he loves giving them Gatorades and water. So I just wanna make sure that we have those ready for the trash men. So yeah, that's basically what our days, like basically, look like when I'm not filming. I'm just working around Ali's schedule to do YouTube things and get things done. Um, so yeah, and I'm usually not wearing makeup. I'm usually like in sweatpants and a baggy hoodie. No makeup, hair's not done, it's up in a bun. Just working throughout the day because I edit on days that I'm not filming. Into your driveway, it's a Saturday night. You look like a million bucks wearing that dress I like. You're smiling, but there's something missing you in your eyes. Girl, I can tell that you have something on your mind. But I will make you forget all your sorrows. Let go like there's no tomorrow. Let's have a drink, just relax, all your problems will fade If you're ready for a good time, come yeah, on the me There's a party in the backyard, that's a party It's around 11.30 now, I just got Ali to like eat his lunch He's just picking out stuff and honestly just really want Lucky Charms um, But I had to call the doctors because Ollie's been sick for like the last week and I honestly think it's either allergies or he's got a sinus infection, an ear infection, something. He's just got snot coming right out of his nose. It's disgusting. Um, and he's having like a hard time breathing. If the video that I'm like um, editing today, that like talks about like how I've been helping him like go to sleep and stuff. So like that video will be up before this one. So we're actually going to the doctors and just figuring that out. So this is how pretty much I vlog. Like I vlog and then like I'll update you guys later on how things are. So yeah, we're going to the doctors today. So, doctors Trump doing YouTube things. So the children basically like have to come first, like always. So if I don't get a video done or if like something's happening throughout the day that it's just not not a good day to vlog, then I just skip that day. Like I know I have a dentist appointment coming up, so um, I will not be vlogging that day. But the kids both have dentist appointments. Um, next week so I will be doing like vlogging a very busy day of a mom with dentist appointments and stuff so like I will be vlogging that uh, just to have some content so today like we'll keep vlogging uh, but I try to avoid like really big things like my nephew's birthday party I was gonna vlog that and then I just it was too chaotic to vlog that so certain things I just don't vlog because it's really hard to do that um, I want to be in the moment with my children be in the moment with the rest of my family um so i don't vlog like crazy when a lot of people are around not because i don't like vlogging in front of them it's just because it's hard to be there and like enjoy the moments when you're just in front of a camera all day um so yeah i have to take him to the doctors around three but i'm still gonna work on my youtube stuff the cha the plans have just changed um like last week i was supposed to film like pretty much all week and i just had a terrible week that i just the videos looked terrible, so I just didn't vlog. So yeah, sometimes it works out and sometimes it doesn't. Say please. What do you want? You want cereal? Can you say cereal? No, oh, you got, what do you got? Ooh, is that good? No, it's not good? I think it's good. You eating Cheez-Its? No? Okay. <laughs> While we're talking about updates, I actually like got a text message from Tara yesterday after my like uh, speech video went live, the fact that he's not talking. Um, she sent me what, someone on Instagram, like their two sisters, and they have programs that could help with Ollie. So I'm actually looking into that right now, along with speech therapy. Um, I just don't know what to do as of right now. So I'm looking into that course. It's like $100 for his age group, um, and we'll just go from there little update yeah. on that all right excuse the cat in the background because she's just feisty today all right so i use iMovie to edit all of my videos 
So I have a 31 minute video about, well, this is the last video that just went up, um, that will be going up. And yeah, so I have to edit this video and it's mostly talking because I found out my results for my doctors. And then I also wanted to show you guys this cool feature. I have TubeBuddy on, downloaded on my computer and I can search up keywords um, that are good for my videos. So, and it will give you a, like the results for the keywords. Like, okay, a lot of people are looking it up um, and it's like 61 out of 100%. Like, um, a very good option for me to use. Like, people are looking that up. Oh, forgot to be looking that up. And yeah, so this is just something that I have downloaded on there. And then you can also look on my YouTube studio, and they also help you with other things. Like, I just posted this video, and we can go on. We can go on to the edit section and down the bottom they have this whole thing where it says like um, tags to consider because we tag the videos and it helps with keywords and things that are related to it and it gives me ranking so I can do stuff like that and it'll help me figure out some good tags to get my video noticed. So that's something that I use. And then for my music. I have Epidemic Sound. It's connected to my channel and I pay like $15 a month to use the copy free uh, music so I can download anything I want and I can use as much as I want as long as I'm subscribed to this page. So that helps with music if you're looking for music for your channels. Like I said, um, as long as you link your YouTube channel, you'll be able to use it. These are all the resources I use for my channel. I also will mention that I did take Haley Page's course. Um, she has a course online. It's a pretty penny, like it's not cheap. Um, I invested in it last year. Um, I'm not gonna give out the content of it because I mean, that's how she's making her money. If you're looking for free information, there are YouTubers that I do watch that give out free content. So one of the good ones that I really watch is like Catherine Manning. She was a content bug for a while and she does really good videos. She explains everything um, and she's just like really good. She's fast paced, but she also goes into extreme detail about everything and she posts like once a week and she also has a vlogging channel about her life as a YouTuber. So that's one of my favorite ones to watch. But like I said, like one of my number one things on like how I actually progressed this past year alone after taking that course and everything is con being consistent. Like I have uploaded every single week, the same time and day for an entire year. So my subscribers know when to come back and see it. So yeah, I am just being real with you guys about the YouTube life. To be honest, I haven't made a lot, of money, um, a lot of money, but since over this past year, I guess people being off or whatever, um, people have found me. I've, I, ha I blew up really fast in the beginning. It's getting really hard for me to catch up to those numbers. Like I might have 11,000 subscribers, but my numbers aren't the same. Like I don't have 11,000 people watching my videos. I maybe have like a consistent 100 people from those subscribers that actually watch my videos. Um, so yeah, I <laughs> I blew up and then it just suddenly just went downhill. I guess people just didn't want to watch the my type of content, which is fine. I've also mentioned that in another video. If you don't like my content, it's totally cool, no problem. So yeah, my biggest thing is like being consistent and just working on putting up videos if I think it's not good when I'm editing it I just don't upload it and I just vlog again um, it just depends like I really try to be over 20 minutes because that you could just put like more ads on your video so then you can get make more money um, I don't do affiliate links or anything like that because I'm just not comfortable with reaching out to brands or anything yet I still feel like I don't have a big enough following to do stuff like that like my numbers are just not there I'm still working on my channel and just being better at vlogging so I haven't really done any of that yet but that's an option if you want to make more money on YouTube like I said I don't make much but I've made more this year than I did last year 
because I guess people are home or I'm making better content because I'm home. I don't know. I'm just working to be better on my YouTube channel um, and this is how I'm doing it. Um, I also want to show you how I make my thumbnails. So this might be like extremely ghetto, but this video is about like my difficulties with being pregnant and you guys are just seeing this. Honestly, this is probably won't be the thumbnail, but this is what I do. I just slide back and forth and just, because it's a vlog, like I want it to be real. So I'm going to like take a picture of myself. It doesn't matter what it is, whatever, sure. And then I just screenshot it. And it's the perfect size. And then I send it to myself because I actually edit it on my phone. So then I have the Fonto app on my phone and I just use that. I go into my albums and then I just pick the photo and then I just continue on and then I just add text. I don't think this is gonna be the actual thumbnail but I'm just showing you guys how I do it. So then I move it around, I make it bigger to fit the spot and then I use style and I always use white but then I use the stroke as like this blue color or this green color and I make it bigger so it's nice and thick so you can see it and then I use style again and then I always put like the shadowing on the the letter like you could see that the, the difference that it does it brings it forward so then I put that and then that's it and then I just download it so this is a free app that i use on my phone you can use canva i also have canva and i pay for canva um i use that for my instagram i put the image on like a background and then i post it to instagram um but you could use canva they have plenty of different types of wording and stuff like that um i just like the fact that i can bring it out with like the shadowing and stuff they just started to add those features on the cabin to be honest they're not that good so i still like to use this as the the way I make my um, thumbnails. So if you do it a different way, that's totally okay. Like I'm not a genius. I just found this to be the easiest way for me to do. Um, so yeah, I always do my thumbnails and everything from my YouTube channel unless like it's staged. Like if it's a sit down video, I probably will stage it, but most of them are just me just taking pictures from what I'm actually doing in the video. This is my calendar and I just wanted to show you guys what it looks like and how I plan. So this is like what the video is going up that day. Why isn't my two-year-old talking yet? That just went up on Wednesday. Today is Thursday. I'm filming the day in the life of a working mom. There is a bunch of like me crossing things out, trying to figure out things. Like I never filmed this weekly cleaning video. Um, so maybe I'll do that film a weekly vlog like this is the type of stuff that I was working on Like I said, I look up video ideas and then I just go from there like this video is probably going not going up that day, but um, I just sit down the week before and figure out what I'm vlogging and what is going up that week o'clock I spent about an hour editing this video and it's already done vlogs are really easy to do you just watch them <laughs> add some music and they're done um, so this one is done I'm just gonna watch it through one more time tonight and then upload it and then do what I told you guys I was doing and put throw some tags in there and figure it out so this video is pretty much done um, I need to get Ollie's bag ready for the doctors and then we're gonna head to the doctors and come home for dinner Hopefully we're having shrimp um, This is probably gonna be a really long video because I can already tell it's going to be um, But my last video that's going up on Sunday is gonna be like 23 minutes So yeah, um, I'm trying to keep it above 20 minutes because like I said you can add more Ads onto your videos if they're longer than 10 minutes So yeah um, I'm gonna get the stuff ready and then head over 
to the doctor's tower is actually gonna pick us up because Anthony will not be home in time and he has the car um so yeah let's just head over to the doctor's <laughs> okay so I lied we're no longer going to the doctor's appointment I had to reschedule it for tomorrow because Tara could not take us so yeah that's not happening anymore um Ollie I think is actually getting up so I'm gonna go get him and then get started with dinner it's around 2 30 I'm gonna pull the shrimp so it can defrost and then we can start cooking that um but Anthony said he's nowhere close to being home so I could not make it to the the doctor's appointment on time um so yeah I just rescheduled it <laughs> see the craziness of my life mm -hmm. Watch the clock ticking off the wall But tonight I'm letting it go Spend my coin for sure I'm gonna be myself Or I could be someone else No one's stopping me now I'm gonna skip my breaks I'm gonna make mistakes I just wanna feel alive It's just what I do when I'm out so Try not to hold me down Feel alive when I'm in this town Look at those beautiful stars I wanna drive a faster car Nothing can break me No, no, nothing can break me Try not to hold me down Feel alive when I'm in this town Look at those beautiful stars I wanna take a trip to Alright, so Anthony is upstairs putting Ollie to sleep. I've already washed my face. I'm already like ready to just relax for the rest of the night. I'm finishing up my vlog that will be going up for Sunday. And that's what I'm doing. This is the day in the life of a YouTuber. I just vlogged and I worked on some editing and doing stuff like that. Um, I also scheduled some videos and looked up some ideas for future videos. Like I said, it's nothing too hard. But yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed today's video. If you did, make sure you like this video, subscribe to my channel, and leave any questions in the comment section down below. I answer every single comment. I will see you guys in the next video. Bye, guys.